the issue of threshold, Honorable Speaker, I want to support that the threshold must be met from the word go. Thank you, Honorable Speaker. Senator Methu. Hey, thank you very much, uh, Honorable Speaker. I don't want to address what my colleagues have said. I want to agree that uh, on the first PO, it falls by the way because uh, precedences have been set that Parliament cannot be injected on the course of its work. Uh, but Honorable Speaker, you've been invited to make a very critical decision and uh, on the, without speaking on whether the threshold was that one or that two, both parties have come with uh, arguments and counter-arguments. Why they actually think that that one would be the threshold, why they think that that two would be the threshold. Authorities have been cited, especially in the Tana River case, the County Assembly, or uh, Speaker and Kaduda versus the County Assembly, on the number as to at what point you should be able to truncate uh, uh, the numbers, and they actually believe that it should be rounded off to the nearest hole. The defense of the, of the governor through um, uh, their counsel, Katwa Kigen, they actually feel that uh, even at the very beginning of the inception of this uh, county assembly, there had been set a precedence that, that it would be the number. So, Honorable Speaker, you've been invited to make this particular decision, and this is a weighty decision because if you are to allow this PO, then this impeachment proceeding will fall uh, as at now. We shall not have, the jury will not have had an opportunity to make a decision on this particular matter. It is a very serious invitation, and uh, I would want to dissuade you, Honorable Speaker, from allowing or agreeing to fall prey to rule 30 of, our, of the rules of procedure that you make the, this decision on the uh, uh, preliminary objection. Please, Honorable Speaker, allow the 47 delegations to make this decision on whether, well, it could be 67 or 47, whatever would be the case, Honorable Speaker, if it touches on the counties, Honorable Speaker, but allow senators who are the jury, who are the judges on this particular uh, matter, to make this decision. Honorable Speaker, for you on this matter, you are an umpire. You have no dog in this fight. Yours is to just um, umpire. No, uh, Honorable Senators, we need to make progress. I may take your seat, uh, Professor Minority Leader and Senator Kajoni. I've had you, and uh, nothing new seems to be coming out uh, at, at this juncture. And therefore, for us to make uh, progress, you'll allow me to use standing order number one to suspend the sitting for 15 minutes so that we resume at 3.30 for me to go consider the interventions you've made and uh, give a way forward on how we are going to dispense with this matter. Because remember, honorable senators, if in the event that we proceed with this hearing, we have to start from the beginning. The hearing hasn't started yet. We are merely dealing with preliminary matters and therefore time is of the essence. So kindly, honorable senators, I will proceed now to suspend the sitting for 15 minutes and we shall resume at uh, 3.30. Well, the question of uh, the two-thirds, whether the, that is the threshold was reached or not, uh, still remains unresolved. Uh, the Speaker of the Senate, Honorable Amazon Jeff Akingi, has suspended uh, the sitting for 15 minutes, and uh, the House will be resuming at 15.30, indicating that uh, he needs to consider the deliberations before him with regards uh, to that, those uh, particular uh, preliminaries objections. And uh, the most important one in this case 
is uh, the objection that was raised by the governor's uh, legal team uh, with regards to the threshold uh, of uh, the MCS who supported uh, the removal from office by impeachment of uh, the governor. in this fight. Yours is to just um, umpire. No, uh, honorable senators, we need to make progress. I may take your seat, uh, Professor Minority Leader and Senator Kajon. I've had you, and uh, nothing new seems to be coming out uh, at, at this juncture. And therefore, for us to make uh, progress, you will allow me to use standing order number one to suspend the sitting for 15 minutes so that we resume at 3.30 for me to go consider the interventions you've made and uh, give a way forward on how we are going to dispense with this matter. Because remember, honorable senators, if in the event that we proceed with this hearing, we have to start from the beginning. The hearing hasn't started yet. We are merely dealing with preliminary matters, and therefore time is of the essence. So kindly, honorable senators, I will proceed now to suspend the sitting for 15 minutes, and we shall resume at uh, 3.30. Well, the question of uh, the two-thirds, whether the, that is the threshold was reached or not, uh, still remains unresolved. Uh, the Speaker of the Senate, Honorable Amazon Jeff Akingi, has suspended uh, the sitting for 15 minutes, and uh, the House will be resuming at 15.30, indicating that uh, he needs to consider the deliberations before him with regards uh, to that, those uh, particular uh, preliminary objections. And uh, the most important one in this case is uh, the objection that was raised by the governor's uh, legal team uh, with regards uh, to the threshold uh, of uh, the MCS who supported uh, the removal from office by impeachment over uh, the governor.